hello friends, this is Zots. I've been in a very bright place lately. Sorry about that. And today we're going to talk about a perk that doesn't get a lot of love, it's called Hubris, but that is actually quite nice and has a niche use for it that you might want to use at some point. This is a perk that makes any survivor that stun you exposed for 20 seconds, which means that you can insta-down them, and this is pretty huge. Uh, the, the pros of this perk are very obvious, if you get your first chase to be much shorter as a result of this perk, that is huge and very very helpful, even if it only happens a couple times per game. Now, the downsides of this perk, it doesn't go well with killers that need to use their special attacks, it doesn't go well with killers that already naturally insta-down, and it doesn't go well with killers that are too slow to catch up to a survivor in 20 seconds uh, after getting stunned from a pallet, for example, You're just, you just don't have enough time to catch up with the average killer. However, there are a few killers that are very good at catching up, even in those 20 seconds. One of them is the Hag. With a build like this, you have a solid bit of slowdown and anti-healing and the ability to insta-down here and there. If a survivor stuns you, there is a good chance that in the next 20 seconds they'll trigger a trap, and no matter where that is, you can teleport and hit them. I am also a big fan of running this perk on the Spirit. The Spirit has an add-on that allows her to immediately recharge all of her power if she gets stunned by a pallet, called the Uchiwa, and you can pair it with this and do some nasty stuff with that. You're gonna see a game of that. But my personal favorite user of this perk is probably the Dredge. If you're already a very professional, a very efficient Dredge player, you can pretty much guarantee that a survivor in a normal tile after dropping the pallet is gonna get hit because you can place your remnant. And sometimes during nightfall you can also teleport and catch up the survivors that are pretty far away if the loggers are in place. So you will find out that this perk is actually quite usable. And today I'm going to show you two games that I played off stream that will show you a little bit how nasty this perk can be. Survivors decided to <clears throat> send me to RPD for some reason, which I don't have much of a problem with. I think this is honestly kind of fine for this killer. Let's see if I'm right or wrong or what. Are we on East Wing? Looks like it. That means survivors are probably trapped here right now. Oh, hello. Sure, let's do it. Does she get away with this? I think so. Wait. Lithe? Yep. Let's try it out. Would have been nice to get a stun there, but... There should be some lockers there. Let's try it. Ooh, yeah. She got pushed back into the map. The scratch marks are all over the place. They're so ugly. I hear people locking lockers above me. Hello. I like that they're locking them one at a time. That's how you know they've played against a dredge before. One of the first things you learn as a survivor is that- Ooh, ooh, this is perfect. Is it? Come on. Perfect. Excellent stuff. Uh, unless they have smash it, in which case... It's not perfect. Quick and quiet. Beautiful. That's really good because we got two people injured that are contributing to nightfall happening fast. And then we insta on this girl. It's perfect, really. Oh, hi. You might not want to do that. That was so late. Let's teleport to... I think these lockers. Oh, beautiful. Uh, Could have taken a better route there, but this is nice. She didn't really think that through, did she? Uh, oh, yeah. Quick. Yeah, this uh, hooking increases nightfall charges, so... Oh, it happens passively anyway. Never mind it. We're good. Uh, there, maybe? Oh, so fast. Uh, I reckon the injured girls have to get through me here. Oh, this is perfect. Okay, maybe not perfect. But that is pretty good. Yes, 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 do it. Survivors always fall for this. They always forget that there's lockers there for some reason. Oh, they got the survivor of the hook. Nice. Alright, we'll find them with Nightfall. Uh, it's kind of awkward to hook them in the middle, but should work. Um, where are you guys going? We should see Aris now. Oh, there you go. 
See, because they locked only one locker, now they could lock the second one and hit me with the... Hit me with the second one. Good job. We have the lavalier microphone. Uh-oh. 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 So nice that we came out sooner. That was a good life, though. Good improvisation. Mm, I think this room will be your dad. There's no way. Doesn't really matter that she has that, because we're fine here. Perfect. Look at that. You see, you see how attacking and lunging towards a fall can make you be so close to a swapper if they don't have balance landing. If they kept running straight forward, uh, it wouldn't have mattered. Might as well just run normally. But hey, I hear steps on the right. Oh, I don't. Are you hiding somewhere? Oh, that's a bit strange. Where'd you go? Stun me, stun me, stun me. Oh! Nice! Okay, well, that's a perk of running and doing on its own. You don't need to have hubris for that. It doesn't happen a lot with this killer. It doesn't happen a lot, period. Especially if survivors are sharp, but still really good. That you can sometimes get double taps like that. So, where do you go, friend? Um, shoot, there's so many lockers here. Uh, I'll teleport to this one. I'll see RS. Alright, uh, one, two, still three people here. I don't see the fourth one. Could be off the record. Mm hmm. Hello. Where'd you go? Let's go. Someone else is coming too, so someone will be on this gen one way or another. Did a drop happen? There's just no lockers there. Uh, let's come this way if we don't find someone we teleport away. Hello. Yeah, I don't want to let you guys have a free heal. Don't recommend that. Uh, it's life, right? It's life, yeah. I wouldn't have gotten that anyway. Uh, oh, very nice enduring value. Okay. This is easy. Oh, that was weird. That was weird. I didn't get my swing right away. It's my bad. Maybe my misinput. Are you dead, Mr. Fang Enjoyer? Because I feel like this was your third hook. I don't know why. I hope not. No, she's not. Okay, that's good. Wow. They're not doing as bad as I thought. I looked at the gen com for a second. This could be another life. No. I look really grim, but it's not that bad, really. They've got another gen to go, ready. Ready to go soon. I don't think you make that. Okay. I wasn't sure if the pallet was on the closer And This girl doesn't see a single thing, does she? She seems so lost, actually. But she's running this pretty tight. Bloodlust just kicked in. I'm fine. Yeah, I thought the pallet would be there next to the king instead of this father statue. So I had to swing there because I wasn't sure. Uh, again, you wouldn't have this problem if you run Zanshin. Uh, Zanjin tactics, but who does that on killer? Not super common. Oh wow! I just let you do. I just let you do this. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. What gens are left? Oh, oh, two people here. Oh, please do not stun me with this pallet. That would be terrible. Oh, better yet, stun me with the other one. They won't stun me, right? Like, they're not even gonna try. Uh, don't worry. Don't worry, I go for you. Okay, doing this is a problem, and it's the fact that if they start running back, I'm kind of screwed, but they didn't think of it, so... That's fine. Most survivors, you'll find out, are not as aware of locker placements as you, the killer. Especially if you're a hunter, trickster, dredge player, you are very aware of the guaranteed uh, lockers that always spawn in certain areas and you even see them when you when your power uh, requires it so yeah you're typically more aware than them that's why for example that drop earlier okay it's typically pretty good okay I think this is a situation where I shouldn't catch her I really shouldn't be able to catch her Nah, it's like five seconds. 
I mean, I can go for a normal hit, but... Oh, wait, no. Oh, never mind. Yeah, this is what I should do now. This should be a hit, but... Ooh, wait, didn't you just life already? Damn, good three uses of life, man. This person got three uses in three chases so far. I'm gonna swing at this, I think. Yep. Nice. I'm gonna reckon that you just drop and you don't even look behind you. And good riddance. Nice, we got almost everyone. Actually, we got everybody that unhooked. That's great. Let's see if we can find him with Nightfall. If not, we use Lavalier Microphone. Uh, oh! Did they get 3 gen really badly? Where's the last gen? Over there. Okay. One, two, three. Alright, well, no wonder they're all healed. Let's teleport to the closest. Over here. Well, any target is a valid one. I can find you during Nightfall. If you hear uh, Dredge come out of a locker, or even use his remnant during nightfall, you need to remember that he probably knows where you are. Um, hmm. Come on, be lost, be lost, be lost, run into me. Uh-huh. This girl's doing really good, all things considered. Yeah, I think I underestimated her. Alright, good enough. We scare her there. Dead hard. Oh. She's dead. Alright, I have to say, we didn't super turbo tunnel anyone. Oh, shoot. That was hecking close. So maybe that's why this game has come to such a close uh, ending, but we did pretty good. Right. Who did we go for? Mm. I reckon. Oh. That, that was weird. Let's close that inside a locker. So I saw the survivor dying, which is kind of funny. And I saw Kate, who's running around me. I'm more interested in Claudette, see if she gives me a free hit. Mm, let's try. Oh, sure. I really didn't see anything, huh? Yeah, that gen's at zero. They did do four gens, but it seems like the fifth one is, uh, is a bit of a struggle. They haven't even started it. Well, unless they're hiding in lockers, I should be able to see them. If they have distortion, they'll run out of tokens. Oh, actually. When did, when did you start working on this? If they let go, I was about to... She's dead, so... <laughs> if they let go, I was about to kick it, but... <laughs> Please stun me. Please stun me. Uh -huh, she doesn't wanna. She's dead though. She can't do anything here. Okay, replace remnant. Come on, no? Oh well. Get your butt here. <laughs> These guys were pretty good, but they sent me to such a good map for me. Uh, some difficult parts about this, sure, but it's overall a good map and a very good map for corrupt. Good map for deadlock. It's so hard to go from one gen to another. Good map for enduring. I mean, lots of pallets that you need to play around terribly. And a great map for hubris, so I'm actually kind of grateful that they allowed me to showcase this so much. We. Alright, let's see what they brought. Mm -hmm. So, a good toolbox, but not too great, actually, because if you have instructions. GG was fun. Thanks. Likewise. Fun dudes. Um, yeah, if you have instructions, you do not get skill checks. And that actually is a big part of what makes the Commodus 2 box so good. That you get a lot of extra skill checks. So this is good, but it's hardly the best. And we see rare perks like situational awareness, uh, streetwise, saboteur. Flashbang head on the Zujo Manifest. Uh, we never kicked a single gen because we have a passive slowdown build, so this person must be pretty frustrated. If they hit you with a flashbang or with a blast mine, it both applies to Zujo Manifest. So it's kind of funny. And they had a firecracker that didn't work. Oh, I feel so bad. These guys were actually really, really, really chill. And I'm not sure why Feng sent us to RPD, but maybe she has the achievement to escape. So yeah, I'm quite grateful. Uh, GG's. 
Okay, <laughs> we had two prestige 100s in the previous game, and they these guys just did a last second swap into three prestige 100s. <laughs> Which makes me a little bit happy, because it's probably not going to be like the other matches that I had earlier when I tried Spirit, where I would down one person and they would give up immediately. So, thank you if you don't give up. Let's get into it. Oh, wow. And they get this map, huh? Okay, well, not a big deal for Spirit, I suppose, but dang, good thing we had Corrupt. Oh, wow, that was fast. Damn, that Corrupt didn't do too much for the Zen, huh? That's fine, though. Let's go. Three people here. Mr. Skill check. Cool. They're all walking, so... Expect... Specs members. Alright. If there was any pallet, maybe I'd see if I get stunned, but... I think there's no point here. Let's break this. Why not? If she had life, this would have sent her really far. I see her. I think she's going down. Jesus Christ. I guess Yui's not the quietest, but... Yeah, I guess she didn't have a lot of options. I was right. Excuse me? What, really? Who? Uh, you? She wasn't the one that stunned me. Wow, what? Are you serious? Oh, it was it was this guy. But he failed to get the flashies. The, sorry, the body block. Well, that's crazy. I guess you were that good, huh? Alright, I see. Yeah, I guess the person that got that must have been a flashlight user. Okay, not too bad. Let's listen. Close enough. Right, so... The person that rescued me, that, that got rescued, healed up. Good for them. But they still have one person that needs to move to get uh, Claudette back. So I think this was okay. We've had one person doing gens in the background. And they were displaced thanks to Corrupt for a bit. So not too bad. Damn, it would have been really interesting to find the Dwight. But he hit really well. That's really crazy. That's so unlucky. Oh, we revealed. I mean, I was gonna say we revealed this perk, but it doesn't matter. Like, these people, if they did a three, like, like second switch to three P100s, they're all in a party, so. If one person knows about hubris, everyone knows about hubris, and that's fine. I'm gonna check around here just in case you hit. Maybe the person that was here was the one that went for the rescue. Yeah, so once they know about hubris, the game becomes a lot harder. You're not going to get any freebies. They're not going to make any mega obvious mistakes. But you can still force things to be difficult. Like this guy, for example, cannot drop this. If he drops it, he's in massive trouble. See, so he gives me free hits. And guess what? Giving free hits against this killer is rough. Okay, so he was very quiet, and I thought for a second he was off the record, or Iron Whale, but it's because he was, uh, this is decisive? No. It's because he was, um, crouching. So that was quite effective. We got quite lucky. They don't hook at five gems, not a good thing, though. Mm, I'll take the hit. Alright, let's see where she goes. Right, left, right. Alright. Uh, here's what I'm gonna do, chat. Are they healing? I don't think they're coming back. Yeah, let's go for you. Yeah, they healed. Hello. Yeah, no, sorry. What? Dude, they are making this so easy. What if I just tunnel this guy? Isn't this kind of like not ideal? Oh, I don't make that, do I? Ooh, very generous. Lovely. Let him see me go left. I'm going right now. Oh. You know what? That really threw me off. I think he crouched at one point. Oh, but he was a bit eager there. Alright, well. If I can make it difficult, I'll make this gen difficult. Interesting. Stand still. He's running away. Cool. Do I have basement there? I must, right? There's no hooks around. Yeah, I just needed to be a bit careful with the um, background player or whatever, because that Dwight just... Honestly, 
I thought for a second it was a cheater, because I didn't even see him. Like, I was looking forward and I didn't see him blind me. So it did look a bit wild. Uh, chasing this guy right now is like... Super... I didn't get blinded. I don't see him though. Oh, you risked it all on this? You're dead, bro. Alright, well, we're gonna give them a second chance. Yeah, that was silly. That, it was silly that he risked it all. Especially not knowing my add-ons. I could have had the Cherry Blossom to just find him with my heartbeat. Yeah, you cannot risk it all. Like, you, that guy, knowing that he's dead on Hork, he should have been pissing off and hiding in some corner. They are so greedy. Okay, deadlock block this for a bit. We're gonna let him be on the ground. Maybe he can get picked up. Let's just pretend that never happened. It would be really sad. I, I know we were... We have two gents ready to go, but we can't kill someone at five. It's just wrong. But hey, you know, he went from healthy to injured thanks to one perk. Uh, blood, blood, blood. I really don't know. Do I kick this again? In three seconds? I guess we kick this again. He healed. I thought maybe he had inner healing or something. Uh, I guess they're just resetting. Oh, well, I'm just doing the most boring proxy camping of all time. Sorry about that. Oh, hello. Who this? Oh, again? Okay. Let's try this time. I won't let you go. He's so interesting. The way he plays, actually. Yeah, well played, well played, well done. Oh no, it's an injured girl. I mean, sure. I'm trying to help you out, but... Does she beat me to that? She probably does. Yeah, that was a bit obvious, though. Oof. Alright, we saved this gen, we delayed them. They probably have a couple others started, so... Be careful. And she's going in basement, not that it matters too much. There's the other one. That's probably Felix, that's probably Dwight over there now. Mm -hmm. I love how people advertise their Twitch and their YouTube on their names. That's really, that's really sweet. I hope they get tons of views. Okay. Maybe Dwight would be healing Yue. Let's find out. Oh, this is great. Let's do it. Yue would be second hook or first? Nice, on point. Rescued from there, probably... Probably Felix. With will make it, maybe? He's been resetting really quickly. Yeah, uh, write it down in our head that Sir Bruce might have will make it. Which is fine, because we have a perk to, you know, insta down, so... If they heal up, it's kinda nice. Alright, let's use maybe all of our power. Screw it. We get stunned, we get it back. I hear someone else. Yeah, it was probably Felix. Mmm, risky. Risky, risky. Mind game? Not really. I think he says that he's gonna vault it. No, he's learned. He made that mistake earlier. What? Really? You didn't fall for that? Oh, you hit in a corner somewhere? Okay, that's bad, but it's also good because this is perfect for our power. Let's go. We got all of our power back. Shh. What? I was gonna do a long swing, but he was right on top of me, so it ended on the spot. Oh, that was perfect. That was literally perfect. We got our power back after using it. And it was enough to catch up, probably thanks to the activation add-on. Which honestly is just so powerful. You have life? You do. Let's catch him. Actually, it doesn't matter who I catch. They're both dead on hook, so... Yeah, him and Yui are both good at targets. Maybe he has to die sooner, though. Because he was dead a little bit faster than the rest. Why do I hear someone behind me? Shouldn't be so close, maybe. Oh, I forgot. Felix was so close. I <laughs> Sorry. Don't mean to camp. I'm sorry. Dwight, run this way. Um, I'm gonna check. Where the hell did they go? Oh, right on top again. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I go away. There you go, that's right. Maybe if he stuns me? Stun me! Yes, I get my power back. Oh, that's bad, though. That's bad. 
Uh, okay, sure. You slow ball to that? I'm sorry, Dwight. If I'm this close, I can hear you so clearly. And they're going for maybe another flashy save, but unless they get a miracle angle, that's it for Dwight. All right. Kind of funny how little... Like, we're in a jungle gym, right? Strong pallet, strong window, maybe connected to something else. And it all doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Let's go for her instead. We have been so on point with Yui, man. Maybe we're better chasing people with pink hair. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You stand still, they have to run. They stand, you know, they try to play around the pallet. They can't because they don't know where you are. The spirit removes so much power and skill and, and, and simple... Oh, you're still here? Like, it, it makes so many situations dangerous for survivors. And if you play against really, really good survivors, you realize that they still make plenty of mistakes. I thought that was going to be uh, that hard. She's dead. Oh! Um, do we bother? Do we bother going for him? I think we're fine. Good job for them, though. Finishing all the gens. Um, 20 seconds? Takes me... He's injured. He's injured. I think he might die, actually. Alright, let's see how good uh, Spirit without any duration add-ons is. Oh! He's not going for it. Okay. Big brain. Maybe he's gonna heal. Maybe he goes for the other. Oh, oh, that bird is disturbed. He went for the other one. No way. No way. He almost got it. Let's cut him off. Oh, it's judgment, judgmental pointing finger. Um. I mean, sure. Okay. Sure. He's got a cool skin. We let, we gotta let him go, right? Fair enough. Off you go, off you go. Dude, this, this Armin skin doesn't fit. Doesn't fit Felix at all. <laughs> it's so comedic. It doesn't fit him at all. That's funny. It's really funny. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's see what they brought and whether or not we need to feel bad for them. Alright, so they did, they did do the switch, but they had a medkit. Uh -huh, okay, syringe. A medkit and a flashy. And how the hell did Dwight hit me? I guess he just spring bursted. GG, thank you. Anytime. GG's. So, they didn't have Will make it, by the way. It wasn't on Felix, it was on Dwight. So, I mean, yeah, it was a bit wrong. Maybe they use a medkit to heal someone else. I mean, they have gel dressings, they could have They could have done that. Still pretty nice, right, to heal someone else 45% faster. That's not bad. Yeah, maybe that's what happened. Either way, uh, fun match. Kind of crazy that one of them had Iron Will. I guess it was the one we chased the least. Didn't seem to help all that much. Well, GG's.